Film director Mike Nichols, who died today, was one of the most prominent filmmakers of the 1970s generation. He shot to prominence with his very first film, an adaptation of Edward Albee's Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf with Richard Burton and Elizabeth Taylor. The film was nominated for multiple Oscars and won, and won uh, Best Actress for Elizabeth Taylor. Nichols then stunned a film world in transition with the incredibly relevant and of the moment coming of age film The Graduate in 1967, starring a very young Dustin Hoffman as a feckless college graduate and Anne Bancroft as the immortal Mrs. Robinson. The film also boasted a landmark score by Simon and Garfunkel. Nichols was one of the few people to win an Academy Award, a Tony Award, an Emmy Award. That was for his adaptation of Tony Kushner's Angels in America, and a Grammy. His films include several coll collaborations with Meryl Streep, including Angels in America, Heartburn, and Silkwood. Among his other movies, Carnal Knowledge, Catch-22, The Birdcage, and most recently the Tom Hanks film, Charlie Wilson's War. Here's to you, Mr. Nichols.